up mixing by digger. So I'm in the digger again, um, about to make another cob mix. This is how that's done. So the first thing is to set up all your materials. So this is clay um, from Wexford where they have almost pottery grade clay every time they dig a hole. It's known as marl and we got 20 tons of that for 150 euros delivered from just down the road in Wexford. And then this is subsoil that we've been digging out from where we're lowering the ground level ready for our kitchen just down there. And this is the last ingredient here is straw. And oh yes, of course we've got water, which we've rigged up there so that when I open the tap it pours down into the bucket or the hole. Uh, so the hole is made first at the first mix and lined with one layer of clay so that as we take it out, as I take it out into the bags over there, it doesn't accidentally scrape into the lower material. So now I've put um, some of my materials into the hole. I've put about five buckets of subsoil to about one, one and a half buckets kind of of the um, clay. And I'm just going to, that's a big lump of clay there, it's not a stone. And basically I'm going to start mixing these like a cake mixed to begin with just to try to distribute the materials together. Okay. Once those materials are basically mixed fairly well together to start, I'm going to hop down off the digger now and go and get some milk. And there we go, that's my water set up. That should be about enough for this mix. So now it's just a matter of going 